What's up, YouTube? Savannah and John are back at it again, bringing you our top five... Top five CPUs to buy this summer in 2015. Without further ado, here they are. Woo! Up first, we have the Intel Pentium G3258 3.2 GHz dual core processor. I know what you're thinking. John, why are you recommending a dual core processor? Because it's only $50. And this is a more than capable CPU, making it a great value. While this processor will have limitations in live streaming, video editing, and current generation games, it can certainly perform. And when paired with a decent GPU, you will get playable frame rates, even in graphic intensive games. This CPU is also great for overclocking. You should be able to achieve over 4 GHz easy. Up next, we have the AMD FX6350 3.9 GHz 6 core processor for only $88 right now on Newegg. This is a great CPU at a really good price. This CPU gets our best value award as it's great for gaming and pairs well with an Nvidia 970 GTX. Also, a great perk to this CPU is its 6 cores, which will make this a good choice for modern games that are utilizing 4 plus cores. 4 cores is actually starting to be listed as the minimum requirement for some games and having 6 cores prepares your PC for the future. 6 cores and high clock speed also make the CPU great for live streaming, video editing, multi-threaded applications, and rendering. And let's not forget all this at an amazing price of $88. For number 3, we have the AMD FX8350 4.0 GHz 8-core processor. For only $165, this octa-core processor will do exceptionally well in multi-threaded applications and has a decent single-core performance. Paired with a good GPU, this CPU will really shine in current and next-gen games. As we were saying earlier, games are beginning to utilize 4 or more cores, so this CPU is great for 2015 and will prepare your rig for the future of gaming. It's definitely capable of achieving 60 plus frames per second with the right GPU in highly demanding games in 1080p. For number 4, we have the Intel i5-4690K. This is such a popular CPU right now and all for valid reasons. At only $200, this is a perfect CPU for an $800-$3000 build. John and I actually have this processor in our PC and are loving it. It comes with Intel integrated graphics and a stock cooler that you will probably not use for long given that the CPU has great overclocking potential. We'd recommend throwing in a Cooler Master Hyper 212 EVO for around $30 in order to really maximize the CPU's potential. It will be well worth the $30. This processor will perform as well as an i7-4790K in gaming and for $100 less, it's no surprise this is the go-to gaming CPU for 2015. For live streaming, video editing, and rendering, the i7 will have an advantage because of the hyper threading. But for the money, for just gaming, we believe the CPU is the one to buy. For our top pick, and at the end of the price range, we have the Intel i7-5820K 6-core processor. This processor really is just a monster, and it's only $300 right now at Micro Center. This is a hexacore, but it does have hyper-threading, which effectively makes it a 12-core CPU, making it a force to be reckoned with in heavy workloads, video editing, 3D modeling, and rendering. This is on the X99 platform, which have slightly more expensive motherboards and RAM when compared to the Z97 chipset. However, this CPU is highly future-proof with 6 cores, since games are now starting to recommend quad-core as a minimum requirement. Being that there is only a $30 difference between the i7-4790K and the i7-5820K, the 5820K is one to strongly consider if you use your PC for more than gaming. Thanks for watching our top 5 CPUs for the summer of 2015. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you disliked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up as well. Let us know in the comments if you have one of these CPUs and how you like it so far. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye everyone and happy gaming.